and this one is um, just a loose fitting shirt and it has this opening so it's gonna be good for breastfeeding okay so I have another shirt that my mom actually got me and it has buttons in the front so I have another shirt um, I don't know when I'll wear it I'll probably wear it to sleep but I have a few shirts for the hospital um, I'm supposed to be there for a short amount of time so I didn't pack too much clothes I got these from forever 21 these are three dollars and eighty cents like I said, you guys know I like to save money. I got a whole bunch of them for the house, but um, as far as packing, I'm only going to probably pack three of these. I love leggings. And I have three of these shorts. Now, the reason why I got these, I got these from Forever 21 too. And the reason why I got these are because they say you're supposed to bleed a lot after you give birth. And I know when I was on my cycle, I don't like wearing... How can I say this? I like everything to be just tucked and neat and tight so nothing can flow out. So I usually wear shorts like these like to bed or underneath um, my leggings or underneath like long shirts and stuff like that. So I got a whole bunch of these. So, so I look to see how much nursing bras are and they're just too expensive for me. Like, I don't know. Like, I know $20. I'd rather spend $20 on food than a nursing bra and I know that is sad but I don't know I'm very funny with my money so I went on AliExpress and I saw these and they are latched just like the regular nursing bras so you can take it out and you know pop whatever you need to pop out and these were three dollars and eighty cents a little lot of three dollars and eighty cents going on in this uh video but these were actually three dollars and eighty cents so I got a couple of these and they came within like a week and a half so I'd rather go with those we'll see how that works out I'll update you guys on how it works out or how it's working but I feel like it'll be exactly like the regular ones because they latch off exactly like the regular $22 nursing bras so we'll see so I'm packing I did not miss these at all I did they say you're supposed to bleed a lot, and I know they say the, the hospital offers you um, a lot of things to take home and a lot of things that you, you know, need and stuff like that, but I'm just going to bring it just in case. Like I say, I overpack. I'd rather overpack than underpack. The other thing I'm bringing is this pillow. This is for me. This is going to be um, for when I get into the tub to give birth to Nugget. I want to be comfortable. So this is, I'm probably going to have this blown up after this video, just in case, because I am 38 weeks, I'm going to be 39 tomorrow, and we just never know what will happen. So a few things that I'm bringing, I can't show them physically because I'm using them right now, which is my camera, the battery, the charger, um, extension cord, um, and also I'm going to be bringing my phone charger, obviously, I want everything to be charged. I'm not going to be filming like the details of the birth. I'm not supposed to be filming anyway, but I just want it personally for me. If it actually comes out great, I'll share it with you guys. I would love to share that with you guys. But um, I'm just going to put the camera on in the room and we'll see what happens. We'll see what I can sneak in. So another thing that I am bringing, I don't know if I'll end up using it or not, but uh, my yoga mat. I got this from Rainbow. This is originally $7, but it was on sale for $3. So I got a $3 yoga mat. Keep trying to tell y'all I'm putting y'all on. I don't know if I'm going to end up using it, but like I said, I'm bringing it just in case. And I've been stretching this whole time, and it helps me feel better. So I can get some stretching in, and it helps me relax. I'm going to bring it. So there's that. So on to Nugget stuff. Here's this little... His little jacket. I'm gonna get makeup on it. Um, sidebar, comment down below with um, a time where you got some like unwanted advice because we definitely got some when we went to go pick this up. We were on the line and the lady took us off the line. Like, I have a better coat to show you and this is whack and you don't wanna spend such and such money and he's gonna grow out of it and blah, 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 and this and the third. So we're like, okay, so let's go see the coat. So she showed us this big, bulky, huge winter coat. And 
it was a little bit more than this one and she was just like kind of talking down on us because we wanted this coat and she was like yeah because when you're gonna be walking to the bus and blah 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 and unless you guys drive and we were just like well we drive and we don't want our son overheating in the car we didn't say that but we wanted to <laughs> so if you had a story where you got some like unwanted advice like granted i appreciate everyone's advice and i luckily haven't had to come into anything negative with you guys i love you guys you guys like family but um comment down below with the story time where you were pregnant or you had a child and somebody just gave you some type of advice where you were just like so anyway moving on to his little outfit so these pants are from carter's the jacket was from carter's too so we got this from carter's this was actually a gift all of his clothes except for the jacket thankfully were like baby shower gifts i'm really thankful for everybody that gave gifts for our baby shower so i have this this is from carter's too it's a newborn no one and i have this hat they came with these hats but i don't know which one i'm the i don't know which one i'm going to use on him um we just have to wait to see when he gets here like if his personality feels like He's giving me like, you know, mouse ears, we'll use this one. If not, if he's more chill, we'll use this one. Like, I don't know. I don't know. I'm just going with the flow. And then also this is his shirt. And the thing that I like about um, Carter's newborn stuff, I like the fact that for the newborn, they have the already built in like um, things to cover their arms so they don't scratch their face. They already have those, so I don't have to bring an extra set of those like little glove things for him. I'm also bringing flip-flops with me to take a shower in the hospital. And there's two other things that I don't have in this video because I'm literally about to go out and get them now rolled. I don't know what kind of roll. And I'm also going to get those little flip-flop things and make like the fuzzy slippers because I want some cute slippers to walk around with in the hospital and some thick socks so that is all for what's in my hospital bag i just don't have the actual bag i'm probably gonna end up using like a small suitcase um so wish me luck and send blessings my way you guys i'm excited i'm happy i hope you guys enjoyed this video i love you all and stay blessed